In long documents like this one, I sometimes have trouble finding a specific word or phrase that I know is in there somewhere. The Find feature can help by searching the document for you. Click the Find command on the ribbon, then type the word or phrase you're looking for. The results will show up in the left pane and will also be highlighted in yellow. You can use the arrows here to jump to each instance of the word. If it's a word that appears multiple times, you can scroll through a list of the results. At times, you may find that you've made a mistake throughout your document, or you need to swap a certain word or phrase for another. For that, you can use the Replace command instead. I actually need to change Sewanee Review to the abbreviation SR. Now, when you're ready, click Find Next in the dialog box, then click Replace. Replace All can save you even more time by changing every instance in the document automatically. When it comes to using Replace All, though, it's important to remember that it could find matches you didn't anticipate and might not want to actually change. Generally speaking, you don't want to use Replace All because it doesn't give you the option of skipping anything you don't want to change. So you should only use this option if you're absolutely sure that it won't replace anything you didn't intend it to. Now that you know how to use Find and Replace, you can put this time-saving technique to work in your Word documents.